You know, the latest polls heading into today, election day, did show that, as you said, this virtually was a toss up. So we could have a very interesting night tonight, possibly a nail biter. Now I'm at the La Playa Beach Resort in Naples. This is Rick Scott's hometown. And behind us, some of his supporters are starting to gather for his election night watch party. The doors just opened at seven. So we expect uh, to see a lot more people coming in in the next half hour or so. Now what you have with this race is two candidates who both know how to win elections and they are duking it out in what has been the most expensive race in Florida history. It's also a race that if you live in Florida, you know voters have been barraged with thousands of TV ads and some pretty bruising personal attacks. And as we said, the polls show that heading into today, this race was a toss up. There is also much at stake. There are 40 media outlets here tonight, including the national media. And one reason for the extreme interest is this race could have an impact on the balance of power in the U.S. Senate. So a big question tonight for Scott is how will the governor's race impact this race? You have a race at the top of the ticket with two fierce partisans who have energized their bases. So it remains to be seen tonight what effect that will have on this U.S. Senate race. Now let's go to my colleague Summer Knowles who is live at Senator Nelson's watch party. Summer.